Let me go see if I can... There's bosses over here. how this whole area finished. Let's see... 52... 53 59, so I just need six more quests. Um, I have a lot of... I mean, I have eight major quests, so... <laughs> it's pretty much already a done deal. I have two sky shards. Chest, refine raw materials five times, consume one drink. So I feel like at this point, I'm still good on that. 22 minutes. Uh, I have a skill point. Get that in a bit. I'm literally about to level up, so. And then let's see. Achievements. Got Stone Cold Falls Cave Delver. Got all the caves. Master Explorer, nice. Control Destroyer. Let's see. Hold discovered. So apparently, this is another area with another quest line. However, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and actually get the two sky shards that I'm missing. And I think one of them should be somewhere like here, I'm thinking. Based on what I remember missing and getting and stuff. Check. It's a little dub. Um, let me grab. Let me just find these two sky shards and then I'll level up and stuff. There's a quest over here. I'm guessing this is for this place. Run! Goblins have overrun our fields! Okay. Have a care, traveler. My lord Rogar's fields are overrun with hideous goblins and spiders. Whatever business you have here, best come back another day. Perhaps I can help. You must come of spirited stock. If you truly wish to help, speak to Hrogar up at the manor house. Shores, bones. We need more like you at the hold. We've already lost too many to the goblins. I'll speak to Hrogar. See the residents of Hrogar's hold from goblin invaders. Okay. Talk to her. Well, I guess I do this one right now. Let me level up. Choose one: maple, oak, or beech. Oh, I'm 26 to 34. Why the hell would I not want that one? <laughs> um, let's level up. I have two points here. Let's see. Casting Dawn's Wrath ability. Heck yeah. And one more. 
Let's see. Heavy armor. Increase the magic or stamina your heavy attacks restore. Nice. Ah, spiders. Oh, so this is the place that was attacked after that damn mage. This is pretty crazy, uh, good place. Get out of here. Oh, great. You were instrumental in crushing the Daggerfall army at Devon's Watch. Indeed. These once fertile lands have been reduced to ash and dust. My fair Edwina must be ashamed of me. I am a poor protector. Bro, what is up with your face? You look like you got stabbed. With like needles. You good? How can I help Hogar? How did a Nord come to have a hold in Stone Falls? That's a better question. I was wounded in battle during the Akaviri invasion of Stone Falls years ago. A sweet soul named Edwina nursed me back to health. Though her family disowned her, we were married a few years later. She has given much for our love. What were their objections to your marriage? Many of these milk drinkers consider it heresy for a dark elf to marry one of another race. As if the three care who we love and live for. Indeed. Despite the hatred, Edwina and I have stood strong. Our love and land has endured. Until now. I've come to offer you aid. How can I help? The goblins have slaughtered many of my men. Even my eldest son has been sent to his funeral pyre. Now my youngest son, Bjorik, has gone missing. Trolls, blood traveler. These little vermin are a plague on us. What do you need me to do? My middle son, Gar, is leading the search for Bjorik west of the hall. Go help him find his missing brother and end the nightmare that has befallen my household. I'll speak to your son. Speak to my son, Gar, outside the manor house. Offer to help find Bjorik. I couldn't bear to lose another son. Why are the goblins attacking? Those beasts and their bugs lair in the mountains north of here. They scuttle along the coast, catching fish and squatting in caves. Then the Covenant soldiers came to Stone Falls. The invaders had disturbed the goblins? They used the caves along the coasts as supply drops for landing troops. They drove the goblins from their caves and killed their spider queens. Mm -hmm. Now the animals are searching for new lands. They're trying to take our home. Jeez, relax, man. Pop a blood vessel or something. Huh? All right, Gar, where you at? Well. Well. Well, what? Looking for Gar. Relax. These goblins are merciless, stranger. They don't feel pity or remorse or fear. And they won't stop until they're killed. Your father sent me to help you find Bjork. You want to help? Get out there and kill some of those stinking gobs. Bjork is nearby. I heard him call my name. If you can distract the gobs, I think I can get to him. Meet me here when you're done. Okay, kill goblins and spiders. Hello. 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 Hey, whoa. Oh, come on. Reset. Wasn't even that far. That's four. Here's two more. There you 
going? Feasting on dead bodies. To heal you, punk. Grab you. Grab you. Grab you two guys. Set, bro. That's fine. Your attack on those vermin was heroic. You made them regret the day they left their stinking dens. <laughs> yes, was Gar able to find Bjork? We're in trouble. Your diversion worked, and Gar went looking for his younger brother. That's the good news. The bad news is the goblins are gathering for a final attack on the hold. Quickly, get to Hrogar and warn him. Who's Barasa now? Barasa and Aldrich. What news of my sons? Has Bjorik returned? The goblins are gathering for another attack. Warriors, to me. Protect the hall and safeguard the innocents. Defend the hold! I've got your back. Do I. Huh? Below? Going to the cellar? Defend the hall! Slay the goblins! Hmm? Where the hell are you guys going? I think it's bugged out because this other player just finished it or something. Maybe I need to reset it. Probably need to go upstairs and then come back. Alright, let's try it again. Not saying above? What? Okay. Defend the hole! Slay the goblins! Aha! Oh. There we go. Kill them all! Down. Oh yeah? The leader! Oh damn. Shut up, shut up. Iskramor! We've won the day! Fine Gar. Alright, let me use another scroll and a crown meal.
What? Fafnir. Ugh! Shaw's bones! You have to help! Ugh! Miserable gobs! What happened? Where are Gar and Bjork? They're missing! We found Bjork. We were escorting him home when we were ambushed. The goblins must have taken them both. Great. Ugh. The spiders encased their prey in cocoons. If Bjork and Gar were taken, you'll probably find them trapped in one of those silken prisons. Where should I look for them? You'll find spider cocoons along the beach east of the manor house. Look there. Show no mercy to these craven goblins and their spider pets. As you see. Dead person. Dead person. Another dead person. Where are you going? The there goblins go. have captured Gar. They took him into a cave near the beach. It's for Gar and the Goblin Cave. Follow me. Can we do that? I can't believe we killed the chieftain inside the hall. What the hell? Why is there a nice ass tree over here on the ground? And what the hell is this? Oh, it's this guy. We're in the heart of the cave, friend. Now is the time to strike. What do you say? Think we're mighty enough to take on the goblin warlord and his spider queen? How can we defeat the goblins and spiders? Crush the eggs! Crush them! That will draw out the ugly spider queen and her goblin ally. Sovngarde awaits! We'll kill these beasts! Oh, come on, man. I'll watch your back while you crush spider eggs. Great. Weapons out. Here they come. For Bjork, for Froga, for Isgramor! One the day, I'll meet you at the hall. And a little tree. Hey, a chest. Endeavor completed. Wait, where the hell? Where the hell do I go? Oh. Before I go talk to Rover again, let me go ahead and get out of here. And then go finish off this one real quick. Savages are still close. And the lore book. 
Monomyth, Dragon God, and the Missing God. See, Imundu's conflict and disparity are what bring change, and change is the most sacred of the elven forces. Change is the force without focus or origin. Simply put, the schism in the human and Aldmeri worldview is the mortal's relationship to the divine. Humans take the humble path that they were created by the immortal forces, while the Aldmer claim descent from them. It doesn't seem like much, but it is a distinction that colors the rest of the diverging mythologies. All Tamrilaic religions begin the same. Man or Mer, things begin with du a dualism of Anu and his other. These twin forces go by many names. Anu Padme, Anu Elisithis, Akel, Satak Akel, Is Is Not. Anuel is the everlasting ineffable light. Sithis is the corrupting and inexpressible action. In the middle is the gray maybe or Nern in the Elnofex. In most cultures, Anuel is honored for his part of the interplay that creates the world, but Sithis is held in highest esteem because he's the one that causes the reaction. Sithis is thus the original creator and this ent entity who intrinsically causes change without design. Even the Hist acknowledges this being. Anuel is perceived of as as order opposed to the Sithis chaos. Perhaps it is easier for mortals to envision change than perfect stasis. Than perfect stasis. For often Anuel is rele relegated to mythic background of Sithis's fancies. In Yokodan, full tales which are among the most vivid in the world, Satak is only referred to a handful of times as the hum. He is a force so prevalent as to be not really there at all. In any case, from these two beings spring the Eight Ada, or original spirits. To humans, these Eight Ada are the gods and demons. To the Aldmer, the Adra, Daedra, or the ancestors. All the Tamarilic pantheons fill their rosters from these Eight Ada, though divine membership often differs from culture to culture. Like Anu and Padme, though, everyone, every one of these pantheons contains the archetypes of the Dragon God and the Missing God. The Dragon God is always related to time and is universally revered as the first god. He is often called Akatosh, often called Akatosh, whose perch from eternity allowed the day. He is a central god of the Cyrodiilic Empire. The missing god is always related to the mortal plane as and is a key figure in the human slash Aldmeri schism. The missing refers to either his palpable absence from the pantheon, another mental dis distress that is interpreted as a variety of ways, or the removal of his divine spark by the other immortals. He is often called called Lorcan and his Epitaphs are many, equally damnable and devout. Note that Tamriel and the mortal plane do not exist yet. The gray maybe is still the playground of the original spirits. Some are more bound to Anu's light, others to the unknowable void. The constant flux and interplay increase their number, and their personalities take long to congeal. When Akatosh forms, time begins, and it becomes easier for some spirits to realize themselves as beings with a past and a future. The strongest of the recognizable spirits crystallize. Mephala, Arche, Ifra, Magnus, Rapuga, Etis, etc., etc. Others uh, remain as concepts, ideas, or emotions. One of the strongest of these barely formed urge that the others call Lorcan details a plan to create Mundus, the mortal plane. Humans, with the exception of the Red Guard, see this act as a divine mercy and enlightenment whereby lesser creatures can reach immortality. Aldmer, with the exception of the Dark Elves, see this as an act of cruel deception, a trick that sundered their connection to the spirit plane. Interesting. Right, where the hell is this thing? Huh? Examine. Spot crab shell is discolored as if from poison. The beast that killed it might be nearby. Okay, the question is how do I get over there? Do I swim around?
looking at the sunset. Where is it? Sunrise? Yeah, sunrise. To Rogar. Leave me alone, you bastards. Save me, guard. Oh, God. Kill them all. The attacks are faltering. You've driven the goblins back. Garnai defeated the goblin warlord and the spider queen. Shores, bones, traveler. Without your help, we'd be attending my son's funeral instead of celebrating a victory over the goblins. I'll never forget how you helped to defend my hold. All right, cool. Kill the goblin warlord leading attacks on the Father. hold. I brought the head of the Goblin Warlord. Oh. Is that it? Uh, I was expecting a little bit more conversation, but alright.